Hello and welcome to Crazy Hank TV. Today I'm going to talk about two shows that might be my favorite shows of all time. If you're paying attention, I have a lot of favorite shows, but I'm talking about Deadwood and Justified. Now, they both have something in common besides being a great show. They both star Timothy Oliphant. Um, so I thought it'd be fun today. Which character of Timothy Oliphant do you like more? Seth Bullock from Deadwood or Raylan Givens from Justified? Now, my wife seems to think that Raylan Givens is sexier than Seth Bullock. Same guy, but she seems to think he's sexier than Seth Bullock, and that's why she would pick Raylan Givens. Um, so what we're gonna do is I'll give a little quick, you know, recap of what I think of each character, and then you, you, the viewer, decide in the comment section, I want such and such, and go from there. You can leave comments, and you know, you don't just have to write the name, it's say why I thought this, but I thought it'd just be fun to do and see, because both characters, uh, Timmy Oliphant, it, it's not fair that he's handsome and talented. It's just, it's just not fair, but I'm, I'm not going to complain. But he does a great job with both characters, and, and they are different. So starting with Seth Bullock, he came, he came to Montana with his uh, uh, partner, Saul Starr. They were going to open up, they opened up a hardware store. And then, you know, he quickly became, you know, there, you, you really learn right away that Seth Bullock is a man of honor. He's a man of conviction. He's not a lot of fun. I mean, he's he's fun, but he's not he's not he's not a jokester. He's a very serious guy. He I used to like when he would get mad, grab his nose like that, and all that different stuff. Uh, he was he he again he but he had convict. Like I said earlier, had convictions. He, he was someone you wanted on your side because he would do the right thing. Um, his scenes with Ian McShane are some of the best scenes in the TV show Deadwood. They, 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 they really work well off. I mean, Ian McShane's a fantastic actor, but Seth Bullock went toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. I'm sorry, Timothy Oliphant went toe-to-toe -to -toe with him and did a great job. And it just, it was, it's just a show I never get tired of watching. I've seen it, I don't know how many times to rewatch. I think there's 36 episodes. We finally got the movie, which I always joked, I go, because in Justified, a lot of actors from Deadwood are in Justified. So they could have just, why didn't they just do the movie then? But we finally got the movie and it was all good. Um, but again, with Seth, it, it, it's, it's, it's not someone you're gonna go out and, and have a party with or something like that. He's just, he's just a very uptight individual, but again, honest convictions and all that stuff. So that's Seth Bullock. Now we go to Raylan Givens. Now Raylan Givens is a dedicated marshal, kind of, you know, a jokester, beats to his own drum. He plays by his own rules. Um, he will get the job done. I think he killed a lot more people. It, it, Raylan Givens has killed a lot more people than Seth Bullock did in Deadwood. A, a lot more. I think probably in the first episode. Um, immediately, the pilot, both, both pilots of each show, I was hooked right away. Um, I like Seth, Seth Bullock. I always thought that Timothy Oliphant, from his character in Justified, Raylan Givens, if they ever decided to reboot, Dirty Harry would be perfect for the part of Dirty Harry. Not that I know, if, not that, that they want to do it or he would want to do it, but he would make the perfect Dirty Harry if they ever did, because uh, Clint Eastwood just turned 90. I don't see him coming back and playing Dirty Harry, maybe a little rascal, but uh, he's pa he's past his prime. But, but, but Raylan Givens, he had daddy issues. His dad was, uh, he didn't get along with his dad. His dad was a terrible parent, and you can see why he is the way he is. I mean, he came, his, 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 I look like the scenes with his, his, his close personal friend was Boyd Crowder and they have an interesting relationship during the series and it makes for fun television. But Raylan seems like he'd be a fun guy to hang out with. Uh, again, not that Seth wouldn't, and I'm not trying to sway you guys either way, but it just, it just seems like Raylan has more of that quirky type personality or be fun loving. He likes to drink. He definitely likes to drink. Um, he loved, still loves his ex-wife Winona, and I always he had a rough relationship with, with Art, but I always thought that he looked at Art as either an older brother or a father figure, something he didn't have as growing up in Harlan County. But those are the two characters, two great shows. Um, but I want to know who you think is the best between Raylan Givens and Seth Bullock. And that's all I got. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Bye.